Hello, this is Corinda Chadder and you're on BritAsian.com. Well, Gurinda, it's lovely to be with you here today. Could you tell us about the inspiration behind It's a Wonderful Afterlife? I've got a lot of people coming up to me constantly saying, please, will you make another Bender Light Beckham? Please make another Bender Light Beckham. And that film was made seven years ago. So It's a Wonderful Afterlife is set in that West London sort of Asian community, but it's a completely different genre to Bend It Like Beckham. But if you like that film, you'll like this film. Yo, honey girl, sweet sugar dumpling. Huh? I got speed dates to my left. Hi. I got speed dates to my right. <laughs> Don't you worry about me, I'll speed date you all night. Hi, I'm Goldie Note, and you're watching BritAsian.com. Could you tell us your reaction when you found out you were going to be the main lead in Gorinda Chadder's new movie? Um, I I was absolutely thrilled. I think I released lots of endorphins, actually, when I found out. Goldie, could you sum up yourself to our viewers in three words? Talented. <laughs> okay. Beautiful. Oh, thanks. Aww. And vivacious. Oh, I like that. That's a good word, Thank you. It? How do you like that? That's much easier to have someone else do it. Thank you. <laughs> do him as well, actually. Right. <laughs> Witty, funny, and uh, kind. Hi. Could you tell us more about your role in the film and how it would relate to Asian girls? Right. I, I play uh, Rupee, who uh, she hasn't been so lucky in love. And uh, eventually she, she does meet somebody by the name of Googly. She's a quite uh, self-deprecating character, actually, but she's unblinkingly loyal. She's lovely. And I think that perhaps a lot of Asian girls would, would identify with her because there is a lot of pressure on her from her mother, who's very determined that she meet somebody. Um, and I think they could probably relate to that sort of um, that pressure. Well, all my films have very strong female protagonists, yeah. obviously, because I am. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I wanted to, I wanted my lead girl to be not the conventional heroine. You yeah. Know, she's slightly chubby and she's let herself go and. You know, she's a bit down in the dumps, you know, she's got a broken engagement behind her. And she's your unconventional heroine. No need to laugh. Hi, Sendil, from Heroes to It's a Wonderful Afterlife, can you tell us about your role in the flick and what attracted you to it? I, uh, I play Raj, known as Googly, uh, who's a, a police officer who's brought in to investigate a string of murders that are happening in Southall in the Asian community. And um, uh, my character sent undercover to find out who the murderer is, mm -hmm. basically, and in and, and the process of, of trying to figure out, figure this case out. Uh, ends up falling in love with one of the suspects, um, which is uh, Rupi, and um, and tries to prove that it's not her because uh, my boss, who's played by the wonderful Mark Addy, um, thinks it's her. Murphy here has a uh, special relationship with one of my suspects, Chief. Good. Has Gurinder Chadha had any major dating disasters or pressure from the family to get married earlier? It was. Uh... There was a time when my dad tried to show me a letter that someone had written to him. It was a doctor, oh, yeah. you know, who was interested in marrying me. And I absolutely kind of tore my dad apart <laughs> and said, don't you ever show me this again. But then when we did get married, when my husband proposed to me, my dad did say to him one day, I'm going to show you all the letters I got for Gorinda, and they're this high. So don't you ever put a fit wrong. <laughs> we hear Gurinder Chadha can be sometimes a tough director to work with. What was your experience with her? I think if, if tough means that she works you hard, then yeah, absolutely she does. Um, but, you know, she intersperses that with, with moments of just having a laugh and switching on staying alive and having a boogie. And we had that, but then you're back to sort of working hard again. And I think that um, just because it's a comedy doesn't mean that, you know, it's 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 easy because it, it wasn't at all. Are you tipping the new actress, Goldie, to be like the next Kira Knightley or Parminda maybe? I think Goldie has got a long future ahead of her. I think that she will do some great comedy roles. And I think she'll actually probably do some quite serious roles too. She's already got a part in the new Sex and the City movie. I know, I'm back of the movie, so uh, that's exciting. And I've got to ask before I go, because every girl's want to know, 
What's it like kissing hero stars and girls? It's absolutely life changing. Honestly, really? I haven't been the same woman since. Really, <laughs> I haven't. Happiest girl in the universe. Ha- happiest girl in the universe. Is it? Yeah, I the think Milky so. Way? He is so gorgeous. I've seen him in his underpants. So you're halfway there.